<laughs> well, I think he figured it out. All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and RC model aviation enthusiasts all across the globe. We're back at the St. George uh, Remote Possibilities Field. This is the John Morgan Electric Fun Fly, the 2024 species. We have Brent Hecht, master modeler Brent Hecht, and he is about to put Barrett Hawkhouse's beautiful Arado AR-234 Blitz bomber into the sky. It's just beautiful. It's just beautiful. It's a very under-modeled aircraft, which is surprising uh, given that it really lends itself to RC models. Uh, it is a straight wing configuration. It is a shoulder-mounted wing, so the center of gravity is below the wing mass, so that it uh, is very stable. Um, it's a very historic aircraft. So really surprising that there aren't more of these modeled. Um, this one was completely scratch built by Barrett Hawkhouse. It's flying on on uh, the free wing ME262 power plants. Now although this model is quite a bit bigger than the than the free wing, it actually weighs uh, quite a bit more. Uh, it may not look like it, but it has twice the wing area that the free wing model has. It literally has twice the wing area, so. Barrett was remarking yesterday, it kind of flies like an EDF glider, so. saying that has a lot of adverse yaw. I'll just fly it like a truck. <laughs> but it does fly smooth. It really does fly smooth. And again, you're watching an Arado AR-234. This is completely scratch built. Basically it's shaped and carved foam covered. And then, of course, the wings. <laughs> you got Brent right there. There's Barrett, the builder, with the camera. And Brent on the sticks. So that was a approach. Brent was just sort of shooting the approach, by the way, just to get the feel for the aircraft. That's what you do. It's the first time he's flying it. So he's figuring out what he needs to do to bring it down safely and gently. And now he's doing the landing. He just called landing. Arado, AR-234, St. George, Utah. Beautiful. Beautiful. And beautiful. Awesome. There's Brent. Well, here's the thing. I'm used to it. So, but, yeah. But the more, like, if you can have a little more travel on your stick, you find yourself flying a lot smoother. Outstanding. It used to be more like, like not like this, you know. Mm. But maybe when, you, when you did that to this SR-71, I was like, right. "What's happening? What's wrong with this plane?" And like, I'm really yanking it over here. All right. It's just what I'm used to. All right. To Thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in. All the best for just swing it. We'll get the pilot report here in a little while. Well, then let's talk.